Hello and welcome to another how to do the web tutorial video. Today we will be looking at how to set up a account with MailChimp. MailChimp is a fabulous internet email service and uh, what it allows you to do is to set up and use a, a list of people who can and have subscriptions, people can subscribe to your list, uh, people can unsubscribe from your list and um, it also gives you the possibility of sending you sending out really lovely emails in those really professional looking formats that you receive from people. So um, MailChimp.com um, is where we're going to start off and that's what you're seeing on your screen now. This is the front screen when you haven't signed up. So sign up for free um, and that's another bonus of MailChimp. They, are, um, they have a free option and um, so we'll run through that as well. So sign up for free. So we're going to click on that and then we're going to start a free account. You don't have to enter any credit card details. You don't need to do anything like that. So we're going to put in our email address. I'm going to set up a username, how to do the web. And come up with a password. So Cool. So, create my account. No, oh, I don't want you to remember that. It does not like me. Aha, uh -huh. so there we go. So, as with most um, password requirements, they need at least one symbol or one number. And I've only put in, um, in letters. So, I'm just going to add a number on the end there. And here we go. Thanks for signing up. So then they're going to send me an email with an activation link in it. So um, that's what we need to do next is go over to our Gmail account. Over here in our Gmail account we have our MailChimp client server. Activate your MailChimp account. So this is what you're seeing here is actually an example of what you can create with your MailChimp account which is very cool. So activate account, click on that, and we're away. So confirm your humanity. Are you a real person? Now, I don't think all real people can actually read some of these things that they put in here. But anyway, let's give it a go. D, F, it looks like a capital I, T, S, O. And then the second word looks easy. Let's hope I got that right. Looks like it. Awesome. So, how to do the web. So, once you've set up your account, they then get you to log into your account. And then they'll ask you to write some details about you and who you are. Your email address, um, just some tailoring. Actually, in my organization, less than a year old. List of emails to important. We're going to go no for that at the moment, and then these things. So, following information will help us automatically build your email footers to comply with the anti spam laws. So, how to do the web? Dub, 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 dot. How to do. Now, you, of course, will be putting in your own information in here. Um, Let's 
going to automatically try and load in like this for me, which I don't want it to do. Um, it has put the information further down, so that's handy. Okay, so what industry are you in? Now, we're all going to be from different industries, those of us watching this. So um, you choose what you know. I'm education and training, obviously, because I'm all about training you guys how to use these cool tools. So time zone, choose your time zone. New Zealand is always near the top because we are first in the world. And upload your photo. I don't have a profile photo. There's also an option here for you to subscribe to MailChimp and getting started emails. So if you're requiring to use these videos to get started then you may choose to receive their emails. So go ahead and click that. Alright, so we are here. This is our front um, front dashboard and this is when you log in in the future this is where you will be brought to so um, from here as you can see you can create and send emails you can create a list and start building your audience so the first thing that you really do need to do is to create a list and we will cover that in the next video um, and then once you have a list because you can't send your emails to anyone if you don't have a list you can then create and send emails out and also um, we will also cover putting those emails into um, in subscription links and so people can find you and join your lists. Um, just a word on using this, uh, um, spam is not a fun thing, we've all received it and it's not nice to receive and so I please, please ask you to refrain from sending spam out and only add people to your lists that have given you permission um, and we will go into setting up um, a list, all of that in um, creating a list so thanks for joining me uh, if you've enjoyed the enjoy, enjoyed this video please go ahead and replay the video and click on the ads um, I get a little something each time you click on an ad and it costs you nothing or if you would like to contribute financially from your own pocket then I do have a donate button on my website howtodotheweb.com so thanks for joining me and I look forward to having you join me in future episodes